incoming high school students, rising high school seniors, as well as college students. How we would implement this? Let's break it down, starting with financial advising. Financial literacy and advising is one of the most plaguing problems in not only the adults, but mostly the kids. These students have been living with their parents or guardians for all of their lives, and all of a sudden they reach a pinnacle in their life where they are expected to manage all their finances, balance their budgets, and pay off their loans in a timely manner. They do not have the proper guidance to seek that, and many don't take the time to seek out paid services. What we can offer, we can bring in volunteers and social workers as a part of our organization that would be able to reach out to these students in public or uh, private settings and educate them regarding this in public workshops in classes of 20 to 30 or more. The second aspect is the loan service. The loan service is when we, with our initial startup revenue, we would be giving out student loans since we are not making a profit. The minimum interest that we set is around 0.75 to 2% max. And this is also shiftable based on a financial need and individual circumstance basis. Third aspect is life counseling. This addresses the emotional and psychological aspects of the many of the students suffering. When the reason that they get into depression is because they do not have someone that they can talk to. Oftentimes in high schools, you may think there are certain counselors that are there to talk to you, but it's from being a student myself and knowing friends that have have to look at problems, they're not comfortable speaking to someone on a school campus setting just because they attend that campus. They, and they're also like the same council that does their advising, they see them in multiple occasions, they don't feel comfortable around it. Similar situation in, high, uh, in college campuses. Our counselors could be doctors, physicians, or anyone that they feel comfortable that we can request to bring in and that would work for us on a voluntary basis. And of course, full-time employees would have to be considered with the co initial cost. The last part is college guidance. This of course is primarily targeted towards our high school students that are coming in and said that need uh, additional college guidance and support through to get into admitted into college, find the proper scholarships and grants, as well as college students that are seeking to stay in it. Thank you and I hope you can help me make the health and wellness aspect as well as manage the education aspect of helping college students succeed.